Yeah. All right, what's up, guys? It's uh, Monday morning, and uh, we're gonna start the day off by throwing some crutches off the balcony. All right, you video. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I have a video right here, actually. So. Oh, you want both angles or just? Oh. So right here. Okay. Yep. All right. Just the plan. <laughs> so much for the flowers. <laughs> And that's, what a great day to that's start how morning. you deliver a doctor, a pediatrician, her crutches. Yes. <laughs> yes. Kind of overcast, but beautiful day. Every day is a beautiful day. It's just all about perspective. We're going to head out to Malibu uh, today to meet with Mark Sisson. It's kind of a lifelong dream of mine. I'm pretty stoked about that. Um, he's my go-to guru, has been for a long time, so it's going to be awesome to finally meet him. And uh, yeah, we'll get back to you guys on that. Probably do a vlog when we get there and, and get maybe a little, few little tidbits of wisdom and knowledge about health and fitness from Mark Sisson. So stay tuned. Rasta. Rasta. I've been on that video so many times already. Three game interviews. All right, so we're uh, still at Lauren and Courtney's apartment here. And as you can see, there's a beautiful view behind me. And I'm kind of catching up on some work here. And. Uh, Look at the adventure I find myself in today. We have uh, Nate, who is a friend of Courtney's. Yeah, I hope so. And if you haven't picked up <laughs> on this yet, Courtney is a, is a doctor, and she is doing some work on his kneecap right now. How would you do that, man? I was hiking, and I just tripped on a rock and fell. <sighs> Real uh, glorious way to hurt yourself. And, the, and before you said that you were leading a, a pretty difficult climbing route. Yeah, we've been climbing all day, and then we were hiking out, and I just wasn't paying attention. Mm. That's what happens. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's just gross looking. It's just filleted. All right, we're here with uh, our friend Mark. We met him about two years ago, and we're back. Hey, welcome everybody. I'm hanging out with some great friends right now. Join us. Yeah. yeah. Good stuff. This is a dream come true for me. Surrender and life will happen and it'll be awesome. Yeah, he has a great book out called The yeah. Primal, Primal Blueprint. Blueprint. Primal Blueprint. Come on, Tim. We'll edit that out. Yeah. Primal, Primal Blueprint. Blueprint. Check it out. And if you want to learn how to have a six pack at age 61. 61? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Then the maybe you want to read that book. <laughs> All right, cool. Thanks, Mark. Yeah. So we're at our nest, our nest. We're at our nest right now. Look at it. No, this is the, what is this place called, uh, Lauren? Calamigos Ranch. Yeah, we're at Calamigos Ranch. Um, Lauren suggested it might be a good place to host our, one of a retreat this year. So we're kind of scouting it out. And we just got back from Mark Sisson's house and we're really excited to post all those stuff on social media because I'm addicted to social media. <laughs> That's why I camera, camera around with me everywhere. <laughs> Uh, can't laugh at yourself, you can't live. Bye. All right, continuing our journey here in Malibu. We just got some smoothies at this place called Sun Life Organics. I got the Wolverine. We all got the Wolverine. Oh, there you are. We all kind of. We got all different <laughs> varieties and sizes of Wolverines. I got a little whey protein in mine. He got a little kale in his. She's got, got, got it straight up. Straight up Wolverine. Straight up Wolverine. Yeah. I'll tell you, life out here is pretty crazy. This weather is amazing. This is pretty good. It's a, it's, I would say it's expensive. It's a real privileged lifestyle to live, but uh, it feels pretty good for this day. Yeah. All right. For any of you surfers out there, you may recognize this spot behind me. This is Malibu. This is where probably one of the spots where surfing actually became uh, where it started. And it's a small day, as you can see. A lot of people have this misconception about waves. Waves are like weather, they come and go. So uh, you can't, even though we're at one of the best surf spots in the world, it's, uh, it's a small day, but catch it on another day and it can be huge and perfect. All right, we just got done working out at the uh, Santa Monica Pier again. And let me tell you something, working out makes you feel great. But working out and jumping in the ocean, <laughs> that'll make you feel better. But let me tell you, there's a, I made a little promise to myself about a year and a half ago that if there is a fresh body of water, meaning the water is like clean enough to jump in, 
I am going to jump in that water. Because time and time again, I felt that I didn't want to jump in the water. But every time after I do it, I feel great, I feel alive, and especially it's cold water. So next time you're near a body of water and you're wondering, should I do it? When in doubt, be brave, my friends. Be brave. So we're in downtown Santa Monica. Just got done working out. And uh, let me tell you, I didn't want to work out today. I didn't feel like working out. But I did it anyways. Just to get out there for 45 minutes or so, move around. And man, I feel like, I feel like a piece of gold. Like a new person. Yeah. And it happens every day. So the question is, and I think that's really something that separates the raw bras from just bras. Yeah. <laughs> is that, it doesn't matter. You gotta, you gotta do the opposite sometimes. You gotta do the opposite of what you're feeling. You don't wanna work out, you go work out. Sometimes it's good to listen to your body if it's telling you to rest, but most of the time, you just need to do the opposite. You just gotta do it. You just got to do it. You don't want to get in the water? You just got to do it. You want to work out? You just got to do it. You want to come on a Rob Bros retreat uh, May 28th in Oregon? You don't want to do it? You're scared to do it? You got to do it. Just do it. Get there. We'll see you in Oregon. And if you need to be held accountable, become a Rob Bros ambassador. And we're going to make you do it. We're going to make, we're going to hold you accountable at achieving your goals. Email us, robbros at gmail.com, baby.